What up, family, friends, faithful followers? I'm taking a break from my ceiling fan stuff so I can present the other things that I have said I present on my channel. This is fulfilling the other thing that is featured on my channel. Today, I will be reviewing Dr. Pepper Cotton Candy, and I call this segment Dr. Pep Review. In this segment, I review any of Dr. Pepper's latest products, such as their cotton candy, their latest sodas, their products, etc. <laughs> In our first episode, as I've already said, we'll be reviewing the Dr. Pepper cotton candy. Now in history, Dr. Pepper was the first trademark soda in 1885. If anybody ever said that Coke was the first soda, you actually have been bamboozled because it's been proven that Dr. Pepper was the first one. And since then, Dr. Pepper has been noted as a peppery flavor, invented by a pharmacist in 1885, and pepper being part of the 23 flavors, it's the only reason that Dr. Pepper has held true to its name, along with some other reasons. And I found this Dr. Pepper cotton candy at Cracker Barrel, and so if any of you are interested and live nearby a Cracker Barrel, be sure to check there first before checking other stores, because I'm not sure if it's still being distributed, but I wish you guys the best of luck. Today, for episode one of Dr. Pep Review, I'm going to be reviewing the Dr. Pepper cotton candy for you guys. Let me just pull out a piece. All right, you guys, here's the cotton candy itself. And it has the Dr. Pepper taste as advertised. Now, this has been distributed by Taste of Nature in Santa Monica and Dr. Pepper in Plano, Texas. Now it's tasting time. <laughs> it's good stuff. You should try it out sometime. Well, that's it for this episode. The Harbor Reef Springfield 2 scene like fam will be coming out soon. So remember, life has no limits. So do something new today. Like, subscribe, click the bell to stay notified, and munch on your Dr. Pepper, too. <laughs> Again, I wish you the best of luck if you guys find these. <laughs> Take my word for it, Dr. Pepper compliments anything. <laughs> I love you guys. Stay tuned, everybody. What up, family, friends, faithful followers? Shout out to Ryan Boy for subscribing. Thank you. Also, it has come to my attention that some of you were asking me, when am I going to make another Dr. Pep review episode? I gotta be honest, it is high time I made another episode. This time, Dr. Pepper cream soda this time around. <laughs> we got an actual glimpse of Dr. Pepper's latest product right here. Well, okay, maybe not latest latest, but... One of their newest innovations that surpasses all the rest. The funny thing about authentic blends of 23 flavors, you can never go wrong with Dr. Pepper. <laughs> now let's give this thing a taste. <laughs> Now, you can find these in your local Walmart, ShopRite, or wherever you go shopping. Because Dr. Pepper has made an announcement that this would be a permanent thing. So, don't believe you're missing out on any of the fun if you feel that way. Like, subscribe, click the bell to stay notified. And remember, life is no limit, so do something new today. Again, shout out to Ryan Boyd. Thank you. Thank you, good sir. I never thought I'd ever see these goodies again.
Better hold on to these. Oh, <laughs> what up, family, friends, faithful followers? I got a package in the mail today, and not only was Dr. Pepper cotton candy, as you remember from the first episode, but what else was in there, you ask? Well, this means it's time for the third episode. Introducing Dr. Pepper Jelly Beans from Jelly Belly, yours truly. The jelly beans themselves. Mm -hmm. Dr. Pepper's products never get old. Like, subscribe, click the bell to stay notified. Remember, life has no limits, so do something new today. What up, family, friends, faithful followers? Shout out to my aunt for sending me this, and shout out to Dr. Pepper Museum in Waco, Texas for filling out her order. Thank you to all of those. This is the strangest Dr. Pepper review I had ever done, because never have I ever had anything like this. I've had Dr. Pepper shirts, as you may remember, but never a Dr. Pepper beanie. <laughs> I'm gonna put this on me. Alright, so out of curiosity, how do I look? Please send the reviews down into the comments, and please be sure to contribute as well, because I'm making a Q&A video still. There are slots still open for questions or comments, so contribute to that. Like, subscribe, click the bell to stay notified, and remember, life has no limit, so do something new today!